happy Monday. Today for Leadership U, we're going to be creating what's called a vision board. And I have this paper here, just shows me a couple vision boards for some examples and tells me all about it. But basically what a vision board is, is it, it can be a piece of uh, poster board paper, a piece of regular paper, construction paper, whatever you want, whatever you have at home. And I encourage you guys to create your own at home. If you have a pencil and piece of paper, you can use that. If you have a printer at home, you can print some pictures. If you have an old newspaper or newspaper or magazine, you can cut some stuff out of that. Um, but today I'm going to use this half a piece of poster board and I printed off some pictures that represent things that I want to see in my future. And what you're going to do is a vision board is to for a vision for your future. So what you want is going to be on this board. Don't copy mine and put family, kids, job. Put what you want to see. If you're in third grade, put that you want to see that you graduate high school. If you're in high school, put that you want to see that you graduate college. Things that are reasonable and can be an actual vision for your future. So to get started, I'm just going to take the blue Sharpie and I'm going to write Chris's vision board at the top. So that's the top one right there. Chris's vision board. And I'm just going to take the red underneath it and make it a little swirly just to add some color and stuff. Alright, now I'm going to cut out my pictures. I'm just going to paste them on there and write a little bit under them to tell me what I want. So I'm going to cut out each of these pictures. And like I said, guys, you guys can do this at home and I encourage you to do these. It helps a big part um, in goal setting. So if you want to set goals for your future, this is a good way to write to write those goals down in a fun way that's not really just written out words. It's more of a hands-on kind of way for you to write your goals down. And as you accomplish these things that's on your vision board, you can go through and mark it out or you can make a new vision board and leave what you have already accomplished off of it. So it's a really fun, hands-on way to kind of accomplish your goals in life. So these first two I've cut out is a picture of a family and a picture of a cross. And the reason I'm putting these on here is because uh, my family now and my family in the future that I want to have with my fiancé and my children are, is very important to me. And so that's a big thing, a big goal for my future is to have a beautiful, healthy family. And the cross is to represent my relationship with Jesus Christ because that's also a very important thing for me in my future. So I'm gluing that down. I'm going to glue my family picture down here that I found online. And yeah, like I said, I found these on the internet and just printed them off here at the Boys and Girls Club. So if you guys want to do that at home, if you have a printer, you can do that. You can put them wherever you want to on your vision board. It does not matter. I'm just going to put them in random places. And I'm going to take the Sharpie and I'm going to write above them, below it, beside of it, whatever, what that goal is. Beautiful, healthy family. And then stay close to Jesus. I'm going to cut out the rest of these and we'll explain those too. Like I said, don't copy me, guys. And put, don't put a cross on there and um, a fame picture of a family off the internet if you don't actually want to see those goals. So, let me cut these two out and I'll explain this. They don't have to be serious goals. They can be anything. Like this one, I printed a picture of some horses because in the future, I want to live on a farm and have some horses and pigs and stuff. So they don't have to be serious goals. They can be whatever you want them to be. All right. These next three, 
I printed, like I said, the picture of three horses because I want a few horses in the future on my property at my house with my family. So I'm going to put that one here below Jesus and just write, want a farm. See, they can be silly. And I printed off this picture of a Camaro because that is my dream car and always has been. So you can print off your dream car if you want. I'm just going to put a dream car underneath it. And then this next one is a picture of a doctor. And that one's being printed off because my dream job and what I'm going to school right now to be is a pediatrician. And that's a very important goal in my life that I want and will achieve. So I'm going to put become a pediatrician. Okay. And I have two more to put on here. I'm going to cut those out really fast. This one is a very important goal of mine. And it's just a picture of a man and woman and it says healthy marriage. And so I'm gonna put that on my vision board. A goal in my life is to have a healthy marriage with my fiance right now who will be my wife in the future. And I encourage all of you to have healthy relationships no matter who it's with. And below that one, I just put love is eternal just because that's something, because it already says healthy marriage. So, and then my last one to go on here is a picture of this pretty house I found online. It's kind of what I want my house to look like in the future. And you guys print off whatever you want to for that. But I printed off this picture of a farmhouse and I'm just going to glue it on there really fast. right here and put dream house and you guys can decorate this you can go through with a different color marker and put some hearts all right guys also on your vision boards you can add like i said any decoration you want and if you don't have a printer at home or anything like that to make it look like this one then you can just, you, you can take a pencil or a marker and you can write words on it. You can write just what I wrote, dream car, dream house, um, healthy marriage, whatever. You can use a magazine or a newspaper that your parents have around the house if they allow you to use that. And cut out some pictures and words from that and glue out, or cut out glue on there. Kind of like these two. This one, this person has drew some, or wrote some words on there. And also printed out some pictures, looks like. And this one looks like they've cut out of a newspaper and magazine and things like that. So, I'm going to go ahead with my marker and also write some words on here. I'm going to write happiness. And I'm going to write love. And then I'm going to write... I don't know, prosperity. And then I'm gonna write dream. And you can make it however you wanna make it. It's your own vision board. But here's my finished vision board. And if you guys decide to do this at home, which I encourage you to do, especially you older kids, and high schoolers out there, I encourage you to do this. Um, I did my first vision board when I was a sophomore in high school when I went to what's called Eagle University. It's a program during the summer. And it really helped me set my goals throughout high school and for my college dreams and things like that. So I highly encourage you guys to do this and I hope you enjoy. And we'll see you Wednesday for another Leadership View video. Bye guys.